I rise today in opposition of House Bill 5456. As some of you might know, before joining this august body, I spent nearly 30 years as a firefighter and paramedic for the city of Lansing, retiring as the fire chief with 230 men and women working under me. Over the course of my career, not only did I often risk the exposure of asbestos and many other chemicals, but the men and women who served under me did as well. Firefighting is a dangerous occupation, and losing colleagues in the line of duty is very, very heartbreaking. But so is losing them later in life as they suffer from the ravages of disease that they've been exposed to during the course of their duty. It really is the best among us who often suffer from this exposure to asbestos and other harmful toxins, firefighters and veterans, those who have devoted their life to service, to giving, to making our communities as safe as possible. We always hear about how important it is to honor them and to express our gratitude. And I can imagine many of you this summer will be going to those firehouses and to those armories seeking those veterans groups, those firefighters to stand with them, to have your picture taken with them. Instead, what do we think that this bill expresses to them? That their service, that their sacrifice, their sacrifice and their family's sacrifice is unimportant? Is that the message that you want to send? To tell those who fought to protect us, our homes and our lives, that we prefer them we prefer to side with the companies that have poisoned them. The entire purpose of this bill is to help the guilty companies run out the clock on these victims, to make it as tedious as possible for someone who is sick to seek the compensation that they are due. Not only that, but the delays in the process and the unnecessary litigation and judicial resources that this will cause will ultimately cause more taxpayer dollars to be spent. This is absolutely shameful. To vote in this favor of this bill is to show them that when it comes to honoring our first responders and our veterans, we are all talk. So I ask you today, who will you stand with? Will you stand with those firefighters, those first responders, those veterans, or will you stand with these companies? So I urge my colleagues to join me in voting against House Bill 5446. Five, Thank you very much.